morning, everybody. Happy Monday, November 14th. Satan, this is Keith with Remax Champions in Trinity, Florida, Pasco County, Florida. Hey, I want to give you a quick market update, how our real estate market's looking today. Uh, you know, everybody knows we've come a long way in the last six months, year. Um, we're not in that 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 hot seller's market that we've been in the last couple of years anymore. Um, now it's really more of a buyer's market there. And, and the, the big reason because of that is the interest rates. Um, you got to think about it. When when most people are buying a house, the big factor, especially when they're, well, when they're financing, is how much is their payment going to be? How much is their monthly payment? Can they afford that every month? That's the big thing that, that the lender is looking for, too. When interest rates are low, it didn't really matter what they paid. They could have paid 30, 40 over list. And that's what drove those home prices for that, that period of time. We saw really low interest rates. It got down into the twos, threes uh, for most people. Right now, we're up to the sevens, you know, realistically. Um, that, that makes a big difference. So today, we're looking at, we're still riding the coattails of the market at a high price point. Um, but then also, the interest rates are really high. Um, so it's just, it, there's not a lot of buyers that have a lot of buying power right now. A lot of people are sitting on the sidelines. Um, ideally, what we're looking for today, the, the, the best buyers are people that, that couldn't buy in the last couple months. Um, those might be, or in the last couple years, those might be your VA buyers that, that they were overlooked for a while. Um, your FHA buyers, people that, that didn't have the, the cash uh, to compete with a lot of those other higher offers in the last couple years, they're back to the table now today. Um, so when you're looking to sell your house today, a um, couple things you got to be thinking. We're, we're not at the top of the market anymore. Uh, so we need to be dialing back our price a little bit. We're competing with more houses because there's less buyers. Um, so there's more competition than there were in the last couple of years. Um, that's going to drive down how many how many uh, <clears throat> offers you're going to get on your on your house and how high over, if at all, um, your offers are going to be, how competitive they're going to be. Okay. And then the other thing with those VA, those FHA offers, um, because they're very, they're, there's a lot of those right now, you're going to be looking at some concessions again. Um, we're going to have to fix some things. We're going to have to have a new roof. Roofs right now in Florida, um, things are going a little bit crazy. It's hard to insure a roof that's not you know, pretty new. Um, so keep that in mind. If your roof is old, you're, you might have to replace that no matter what kind of a buyer that you're looking for. Okay, AC, same thing. Um, these, these things kind of need to be, um, again, I'm sorry, it's not, it's not a year ago. We're, we're having to work again um, as sellers to, to make sure that the house is, is in the condition to meet these FHA, these VA requirements. Um, but it's okay. We still have buyers. They're still buying. The nice thing is, is usually when you're selling, you're also buying. So you're also in the same market on both sides of the coin. Um, and right now as a buyer, it's a little bit easier. And when you're thinking about your next your next big purchase. Um, right now, you get to have all your inspections. You get to have your home sale contingencies. You get to protect yourself as a buyer. Um, you have more options. You know, okay, great. You could have sold your house six months ago, a year ago, for X amount over list. Um, but now finding your next house is almost impossible. You have about three options a week. They're gone by the by the end of the weekend, um, and people are cash way overpriced. Um, so you're settling a year ago. Okay. Today, we're not settling. We have options. We can pick. Um, we can make sure that the house is in a good condition to move in. Like I say, roofs, ACs, all these things tend to need to be done today. Whereas a year ago, um, we were figuring out ways to get these houses closed, usually cash, because there's no hoops to jump through with that kind of thing. Um, you don't immediately need to have insurance. Uh, when you're financing, you immediate, immediately need to have insurance at day of closing. Uh, so that means that roof needs to be fixed already. That AC needs to be fixed already. Um, all these things are different in a cash deal. They have a little more flexibility. Um, and let's face it, people that have cash right now, um, they're waiting. They're just waiting. They have options. They can sit tight. It's more of an investment for them anyway. Um, and at 7%, it's, a, it's just a little different. Um, there's, it's a little harder market. The house prices are still at the top, so the, 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 the profit isn't there for them. Lots of reasons. Okay. So anyway, Keith with Remax, thanks for watching. Quick market update here in Pasco County. Um, again, we're in a little bit of a buyer's market now. It's just flipped from the seller's market that we saw the last couple of years. Um, but that's not the end of the world. Um, let's get you into a house right now is the time to get a good deal on a house. Um, there's not a lot of buyers. We're not getting all those over list prices. Houses are sitting a while. They're taking price reductions. Um, it's a good time to go in and throw out a number and see what you can get. Okay. 
Um, maybe it's time to get a good deal. Year two down the line, interest rates improve, and we, we refi at that point. Now we're in the best case scenario out there. All right. Um, again, Keith with Remax here in Newport, Ritchie, Florida. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.